Alright, what's up guys, Peter Jaguar is here again, and we now have defensive tackles here in our Madden 15 Ultimate Team Budget Series. Let's get into it. And for this episode, we have one set of 3-4 defensive tackles, and then another set of 4-3 guys. They will be varying in price and range like we did with the DNs. And basically, the reasoning for this is there's basically a few types of skill sets that we can have with defensive tackles, not necessarily based on the scheme they play in real life, translating to mutt, but just in general, we're going to have some of the quicker guys who may have better block shedding or power move, finesse move, and you can also have your stronger guys who aren't as fast off the ball. Now, with that said, Terrence Knighton is our first 3-4 defensive tackle option. 81 overall here. He is a bit expensive, coming in at around 8,000 coins, and it should be lower if you buy these guys at the right times right now, middle of the week, whatever, no promo packs in the game. It is a little higher than usual, but anyway, 62 speed, so he is slower. But then we have 91 strength, 93 block shed, 89 tackling, 86 power move. Much, much cheaper option here is Terrence Cody, same for his name, but he is 5 overall, lower 76, only going for 650 coins. This is the BCA version, pretty cool here. Again, he's not that fast, but 95 strength, 92 block shedding, good tackling and power move. He's going to be able to lock down the middle. If one of the Terrences isn't the guy for you, Kawan Short is another solid gold option. He is also 76 overall, 84 strength, 87 tackling, 81 block shed, and then decent power move and finesse move. He actually has both of them up in the 70s and 80s, which is pretty cool to see. Down low in the silver tier, we have Jesse Williams only going for 200 coins, which is pretty good given these solid stats. I'm not going to go through them all here, but he does have solid block shed, tackling, strength, whatever it can be. And then 77 pursuit is not bad as well. Then our bronzy is Sial vs. Siliga, only 100 coins, so rock bottom on the auction block here, but he is not terrible as well. He's one of those plug and play guys, or if you're trying to build a fun, lower tiered squad, He's a nice one to have. Working our way up with the 4-3 D-Tackles now, here is Zach Minter, only 60 overall, 150 coins, but 72 speed, 81 strength, and then some more solid stats in the mid-70s. Rashid Hagman, yeah, that name is fun to say anyway. He could have fit in the 3-4 guys as well, but still someone solid here, 90 strength, good tackling, block shed, power move, speed is not terrible as well. Rams have a ferocious D-line in real life, and it carries over to Madden Aaron Donald here, 74 overall, but look at that, we got 80 speed on him, still 91 strength, 83 block shed, 85 power move, 84 pursuit, honestly, he could be playing as a D-end as well, but he's got 91 strength, going in the middle of the field, and he is probably my favorite of all of these guys. Moving up, we have Antonio Smith, very balanced guy. All of the key attributes here are 70 and up, and then he's got a couple in the mid-80s, 85 strength, 86 power move, but then some other solid ones as well. Kind of pushing the budget a little bit here, but anyway, here is Steve McClendon's Team of the Week item 83 overall, and he was going for a good bit lower when he was in packs. Now that he's out, it has been rising a bit. But anyway, pretty balanced, 70 speed, 90 strength, 91 tackling, 84 block shed, 87 power move, 83 pursuit. Basically, a guy who can do whatever you want him to and just overall solid. That's going to be it, though. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned for more vids. Leave a like if you enjoyed this one. Subscribe for more Madden 15 Ultimate Team content. Let me know in the comment section who you think are some good budget linebackers who I'll be able to do in the coming episodes. And also, if you have a favorite of any of these D-tackles or any other ones you would like to add on, feel free to share them with everyone else. But anyway, guys, I'm out. Peace.